mchicha or terere is a leafy green vegetable that's very delicious once cooked perfectly. So I'm going to be showing you how you can turn this vegetable into a delicious side dish. You're going to get started by prepping up your terere, that is removing the leaves from the stalks. Then you're going to wash several times until the leaves are super clean. Mine are ready for chopping. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to be using a chopping board. You can also, also, hey. I'm going to be using a chopping board to chop up my terere. So I'm going to pick a bunch of the terere leaves or mchicha and then i'm going to use my chopping board to help me to chop up the terere <laughs> always use a sharp knife it's going to make it very easy for you to chop up your vegetables so i'm going to finally chop up my terere which is going to help when cooking because the terere is going to cook very fast Watch over your fingers. Then I'm going to transfer my chopped up terere into my kitchen strainer. Once you're done chopping the terere, you're going to transfer to the rest. Next, we are going to chop two medium onions. I've already removed the onion skin. That is the outer layer of the onion. So I'm going to cut into strip and then I'm going to finely dice. My eyes are tearing up. <laughs> so the next step is to cook our onions over medium high flame and add in cooking oil. That is one tablespoon of cooking oil. You can also add the cooking oil according to the amount of terere you're making. Add in your onions and saute for around 30 seconds to one minute. And as my onions are cooking, I'm going to chop up two medium tomatoes remove the top part of the tomato and chop check on your onions because you don't want the onions to burn you can also prep your vegetables before you start cooking as the onions are cooking i'm going to add in two seasoning cubes so i'm going to crush into the Pot as well give everything a stir once you notice a very nice golden brown color on the onions you're going to add in your tomatoes stir in the tomatoes and let the tomatoes cook down for around a minute of a medium low flame you can add in a splash of water if you notice that the tomatoes are not fully cooking so the seasoning cubes are quite optional you can add in some salt and you'll be good to go you can also use a spatula to help you break down the tomatoes as they cook once the tomatoes are ready you're going to add in your terere into the pot. Next, to using a spatula, you're going to stir in the terere together with the tomatoes, onions, and the seasoning cubes. And let this cook for around three to five minutes as you stir occasionally. This is how my 
terere is looking so far. So I'm going to add in a third cup of milk. Stir in the milk into the already delicious terere. And give this about 30 more seconds. And once ready, I'm going to stop to show you how the delicious terere is looking like. Once you're done serving up the terere, it's going to be looking very delicious. So you can serve up terere with some ugali and some mala or even a side dish of any protein. And it's going to be just perfect. So this is how I usually make my terere every single time and it turns out very flavorful, delicious and it's always perfect as a side dish.